Welcome back to Show Me St. Louis. St. Louis influencers are asking you to dine out for a great cause. In recognition of Black History Month, you're being challenged to visit as many Black-owned restaurants as possible around the city. Malik is joining us live to share how this support could lead to money in your pocket. It definitely can, Dana. We're here to learn all about it. I am joined with STL Unites, and they're just going to explain uh, really quick why we're here at Latte Lounge and uh, how you can get some money in your pockets and support some great businesses out here. So I'm joined here with Commando, the Lando, Lando, Commando. He let me say this. I appreciate you for that. But <laughs> please explain, you know, what is going on. So basically, uh, we have uh, STL Unites. So we made a, um, a challenge for, um, for the community to promote black uh own restaurants. Um, we uh, joined together. We got this list from uh, For the Culture. Um, you know, they really helped out in trying to promote these different businesses, especially from COVID, where we had some open and some closed. So we had to get like an updated list. So after getting that list, uh, we made it this challenge for the community to uh, go to these black owned restaurants. And the more you go, you, you tag our STL Unites page. And the, the ones that get the most, um, get a 25 gift, gift card for that specific um, black owned restaurant. So, nice. yeah. Nice. Nice. That's, uh, like I said, I love to eat, and so I might just, you know, go to each place twice so I can get that money so I can come back for free. But uh, can you please just explain, you know, why this is important and, you know, kind of how this is STL Unite's, you know, first event and how you guys keep plan to keep going with it? So, um, really, I was thinking about, you know, it was Black History Month, what can we do to support? Um, in the past, I've seen a different graphics going around about different black-owned restaurants, and I thought, um, you know, like Orlando said, some have opened, some have closed, so let's get this updated list out. Um, and so we have this big group of foodies that we love to work together, we love to support our community, and so with everyone's involvement and with for the culture, um, you know, we thought this is a great opportunity to, you know, support black owned businesses. And, you know, we're already thinking ahead about next month's Women's History Month and what can we do to support women owned businesses and, you know, kind of branching out, you know, not just doing food, which we all know and love, but also, you know, what other um, businesses and organizations can we support and really use our you know, united efforts to make sure that we are doing everything to support St. Louis. So yeah. So uh, that's uh, basically why STL Unites has its name, but you guys can check out all the information that you need. It's plastered right there on your screen. Um, come out and support these businesses and uh, get some money in your pocket while helping others. Why not? It's, it's a win-win, Dana. Yeah, okay, and you're at Latte Lounge because I've, I've been at the original location, but this is, this is the new one? Is this on Washington Avenue? It is, it is right up the road from the studio. It's beautiful. And like her latte flights that are in front of you, oh my gosh, they're so good. Yeah, bring one So back amazing. I mean, we have latte flights. Yeah, I definitely will. Gotcha. Maybe a to-go gotcha. to cup for that. All right. Thanks so much, Malik. And we'll be right back.